A military veteran who constantly works to overcome his own demons is now helping others do the same one mile at a time. Daniel Hurd is in the middle of a three-year journey cycling across the continental U.S. It's all to spread suicide prevention awareness. 24-hour news ace Lindsay McConville met him today during a stop in Grand Rapids. In 2017, I actually did my third suicide attempt. And after I got out of the hospital, a friend of mine, uh, which is actually my best friend, uh, he got me on a bicycle. I really fell in love with it after my third ride. Daniel Hurd's love for cycling has turned into a mission that will take him 25,000 miles. I was physically, sexually, mentally abused as a child and uh, dealt with early age drug use, long term depression most of my life. Uh, still deal with it, just know how to deal with it better. And uh, PTSD from the military. He's faced uphill battles many could never imagine. Now his journey across the country is empowering others to keep going. Has any one interaction since he's begun this journey really stood out? Uh, actually, I can think of 53. Um, 53 people haven't committed suicide because of this journey. Uh, which one is, was one, the same with my own life was ultimately my ultimate goal. Uh, but 53 other people on top of it so far that have had the courage to actually tell me this. Um, makes it worthwhile and makes me so I keep going. The mission resonates with people everywhere he goes, including Rob Mendering of Velocity USA. My father was a veteran of uh, Vietnam and he had his share of struggles after coming home from there. Um, and I think it's great what Dan is doing by opening the dialogue, not only around um, PTSD, but along uh, suicide prevention as well. And dialogues that back when my father returned from Vietnam, I, I don't think people discussed it as openly as what Dan is trying to trying to do. Grand Rapids Bicycle Company handled repairs Dan needed on his rig. Velocity donated the wheel. It's the latest hurdle Dan has had to face on this cross-country trip, but he's using it as a reminder for why he started. That's just like life, and it's about showing that we can get back up and keep going. One pedal at a time. Now, Dan does plan to get back on the road on Friday. He'll be heading up north to Mackinac City, and then he'll be coming back through West Michigan in a few weeks, and he plans to make some additional stops in our area, too. It's having such an impact on yeah. so many people. He's mm -hmm. going to be so encouraged by seeing that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he said that now that people are following him on social media, it's kind of that accountability in a way to keep going, and he's feeling that motivation to keep going because he's got this great following now that he's been on the road for so long. And as the following grows, more awareness. Exactly. So, yeah. 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 He's incredible.